Hey everybody, it is 5.30 and it's Friday night and we are going to be cooking <laughs> with tater bugging. I'm Mr. T and my lovely assistant Lindy is right here with me to read comments. Hello everybody, I'm trying to, I hope I'll get to read comments. It didn't let me earlier. I hope you're not too far away to, for them to hear you. Let's look and see. We're going to give everybody a few minutes to get in here. If I am, I'll move in. Yeah. I don't see anybody here yet. Anybody here? Anybody I don't here? see any Penny's comment. Here. Oh, Penny is here. There she is. Penny's okay. Here. Cindy's here. Hola. Kate Francine. And Cindy is here. Hey, there's our friend Cindy. Whoop, whoop. It's my traveling buddy. Yeah. You know, Girl Trip 23. <laughs> 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 I'm right. not there. I'm still here. Oh, yeah. Priscilla, Darlene, Susan. Everybody, come on in. Glad to see everybody. Share us out tonight. Let's get everybody in here tonight. How about that? It's going to be delicious, y'all. I found out what we're doing. It's going to be good. We are going to do some. And Cindy, listen to this. Patty melts on the black stone. Cindy said, we're planning Girls Trip 2024. <laughs> yes. Already. Uh, for those of you that don't know what happened, I got rooked into the Girls Trip. <laughs> <laughs> it was wonderful. Yeah, we uh, went to a retreat down in Alabama that Lindy had been planning for for ages and um, ended up me having to drive them down there. And it was great. Uh, the girls had a great time. I kind of stayed in the background and uh, hung with Natasha's husband. They had a good time. Hung with Natasha's husband. husband, Slick. Yep. And Slick, if you're around, say hello. Yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> Natasha, if Slick's here, tell him I said hello. That's Sarah, my buddy. Sarah said she made the tortellini kielbasa dish, and it was delicious. Oh yeah, that's that tortellini yeah, and that. and. Kielbasa is great stuff. Hey, Betty, there's Betty hey, Sargent. I hope hey. you're all right. Stephanie's going to be here. Good morning. to hear from you. Priscilla, hello. Oh, Francine said she mashed the taters and added some extra butter. That means she's spread. Mashed the taters and added some butter, yeah. <laughs> all right. So, um, in case you hadn't noticed, <laughs> I have a new apron. Good friend of mine, our printer, Dale Franklin, gave us these. And you see what it says? She's my, wait a minute. She's my su <laughs> sweet tater. You're, you're so special. So I got to show you something. You're pretty. What's this? She's my sweet tater. And, uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Can't. <laughs> Let's get it over here. And look. I am. Yeah, I am. I am. <laughs> and he said he made the, the, uh, the bow yellow for butter. <laughs> that was fun. That's a hoot. That was a sweet surprise. Yes, it was. Thank you, Dale. And he's working on some new projects for us. Uh, uh, I don't know if Lindy showed you. Uh, for those of you that weren't on her lives today, we've got some new stickers that are available. Um, we don't have them in the shop yet. We're working on it. Uh, sun-dried tomatoes. Oh, oh yo, yum. yum. I do love sun-dried tomatoes. That's a good idea, Serlina. Agitator? <laughs> Betty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby. All right, so we've got a bunch in already. Let's see. we got my friend Carol. Share us out, everybody. Say hello to all your friends and tell them come watch. We're gonna make we're gonna make some uh, patty melts tonight, and we're gonna start. I've already got the uh, blackstone kind of heated up, and I'm gonna start by getting the fries on. And tonight we're gonna do some bagged sweet potato fries on the blackstone. And y'all listen. This is not just your normal patty melt. He's got some special stuff coming. Yeah, I am. We're going to make a patty melt, but I made some special creamy pepper sauce. 
You're going to want that recipe. We're going to get these guys out on the Stephanie Blackstone. Stephanie said I can be a good communicator. Communicate. Yeah, communicator. So <laughs> hey, Sue from Dawson Hill, Georgia. Katie and B, they're inducing in the morning. Oh, really? Already? Wow. Yay. Wow. That's uh, my sister's Anne Marie, for those of you who don't know. Melanie is my niece. And that's uh, her son, Brandon and Katie. Katie. Right? Uh -huh. Katie. Yeah, there's going to be a new Tate baby. Well, yep. it's actually going to be a thick pen. But <laughs> a thick pen, yep. Hey, Darla. All right, so we got those going. Melanie is on right now. That's Melanie. Her son. Melanie's going to be a grandma. <laughs> All right, so we're going to get these going. I'm going to turn the heat up a little bit. and. Hey, we're, Stephanie. We're going to let these thaw out right there. They were frozen, so they're going to be, uh, they're just going to thaw out on here and cook as they do. Guess who just came in? Who? Gwen Johnson. Hey, Gwen! They're big buds. Yeah, we're big buds. We got to hang with Gwen this past weekend. We did. I told Gerald when I got in that first night, I said, I want to be like Gwen. She's <laughs> just so happy and just wonderful. She did. Gwen, glad you're feeling better and you're home and everything's good now. Yes. And I'm going to steal the cup from her. I told them the story today. I told them what you said this morning, that I better enjoy that first cup of coffee, coffee out of it, because this is from here on out. Better enjoy it, because it's, it's a goner. All right. I love that cup. I've got a pretty little purple onion that we're going to grill some onions to put on our sandwich. Hey, Teresa. Stephanie, he's making patty melts and sweet potato fries. And y'all wanna you are gonna love these patty melts and you're gonna want that recipe for his sauce. I tasted it. I'm like, oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, so Gwen, Gwen said if I had known you were coming to a retreat too, I would have bought you one. <laughs> I got one, let me tell you. <laughs> <laughs> he stole mine. <laughs> All right, we're gonna put these onions on the grill. And grill those to go on the. Uh... No, we're not. What? No, we're not. No, we're not. Guess what? <laughs> oh dear! We're out of gas. Loopers. Uh oh. About the blooper reel. Oh uh, yes, you are, Darla. He's already working on that recipe. He, he made it up today himself, but he's got it written down. He wrote it down. He's gonna type it up, or I'll type it up. I was hoping the gas was going to make it. Y'all excuse me a minute. But... Hey, Judy. Yeah, oops. No gas. He's not cooking with gas. At least our table's not as um, messy as it was the last time you saw it. There's still, there's a box on the table right there that had, uh, y'all, it's been a day. I'm tired. Uh, that uh, Jeep part came in from Amazon. What else we got? Well, that's a heck of a start to my <laughs> live, isn't it? <laughs> you know, that's how we roll around here, baby. Woo! That is how we roll around here. We'll be right back on <laughs> just a minute. Um, that's our... He walks through... Let me, let me get up. If you go back and look at um, two Christmases ago, you'll see the whole house tour at Christmas. If you walk through here, this is just a little eating area of the kitchen. If you go straight back, that's our kitchen. So, Cindy, Cindy was here and she was getting an idea of where everything is. It was so fun. Um, kitchen, we don't. <laughs> you gotta wash your hands. Okay, we're back. Okay, I'm again. turning you back over to him. No, go ahead. I'm going to wash my hands up here. Wash your hands. Wash. <laughs> Gwen, did you hear that? Oh, tell the story. Wait. Okay. So, y'all, that first night, I look like a little troll. Um, the first night, we had dinner. Yeah, 
Yeah, it was the first night. Yep. And Gwen came over to me afterwards, and she said, uh, did you see there was salad over there? And I said, yeah, I saw that. She said, and the dressing, it was like um, vinegar and what was it? And she was going like this. She's a great actress. And I said, <laughs> oh? And she goes, that's what I wanted you to say. <laughs> so she caught Gerald later. And did she the made same thing. She did the same thing to him. She got him to say all, bull, and full. <laughs> yep. She gets, she said, we're going to boil the oil and then put it in full. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're back cooking again, folks. Sorry for the uh, delay there. Gwen, I bet you are. Hey, Carrie. Yeah, now he's cooking with gas. Let's see. Yeah, we are back cooking again. That's right. At least it doesn't take long to heat up, right? That's right. It does not take long to heat up. Hey, Diane. Hey, Claudia. Yeah, hashtag real life. That's the truth. All right, next weekend, next weekend is deer hunting. Yeah. Gun season opens next weekend. It always happens for my birthday. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> yeah. I lose my husband. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, Teresa said it, this gives you time to do jazz hands. <laughs> <laughs> jazz hands. You're up to 121. Yeah, Great. Know. Thank you for sharing, out, sharing us out. I don't ever get that many. I'm a little jealous. Hey, Karen. Y'all had to share me out to get that kind of number. Thank you very much. Appreciate the hearts. Yeah, All right, Carrie so. Carrie said that they should come before hunting. What now? Carrie said that they should come before hunting. <laughs> I don't even come before hunting. <laughs> Are you kidding? You have all summer. <laughs> I'll give you that. Yeah. Hi, Lou. How are you doing? And there's Patty. Pa uh, which pup are you looking at, Patty? We have Sarge, Pete, and Bo. Yeah, which one are you seeing? Probably Pete. Maybe a little Sarge. Sarge is in the background back there. Let me see. You see him in the door. Yeah. And here's Pete. Hey, Pete. He's always a cleanup committee. Hey, Pete. There's Pete. And Bo just is so good, he stays out of the way. He stays out of the way. Penny Plunkett. Yes, this is an outdoor kitchen that he built last summer. And we are, we love this room. We, any chance we get, we're out here if the weather's good enough. And then he winterizes it and, um, when it gets too cold. And we get to sit out here in the winter. But you can't cook out here in the winter. Yeah, it's, we're going to see about that this year. It's hot here today. The cold is about to come. That's why my head hurts. Yeah. Oh, Connie, absolutely. Share some of his Blackstone recipes. All right. Me. I don't know if y'all can see that or not, but. Am I talking too loud? I don't. You have to don't ask them, I, not to I'm me. I'm yelling, thinking that you can't hear me. Peggy, I loved your video so much. Y'all, Peggy is just this ball of happy. She is just this joyous. Good. I just want I want y'all to be able to hear her. And I read the comments so he knows what you're saying while he's cooking. That's, that's right. And I want y'all to see what kind of what's going on here so uh, you have an idea of, uh, of what to do now. We are cooking on a blackstone for those of you that don't have a blackstone. Obviously, the uh, French fries are just frozen. You can put those on a, a baking sheet and put put them in the uh, in the oven. We're going to warm them up and crisp them a little bit right here on this black stone. We're grilling some onions. We're going to do some burger patties uh, and make some patty melts. Regina, you were smart. She she said I'm late. I was eating. She ate before she. Ate, so. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, Penny, he's, he's very old, he's my baby, and he gets very anxious when food is being cooked, food is the world, 
It is. That's uh, become his world. Yes, it is. All right, we're we're getting some heat up here now. We finally got some gas. Yep. Yeah. Well, this guy's got a hungry wife. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Her mouth, ever since she found out we were going to do patty mounts, her, 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 she has been uh, hungry. I skipped lunch. We had a we had lunch, though, so I usually skip lunch before we do that. Oh, Patty, I love hearing that. We have three rescue dogs and a rescue cat, so... I love that. We do that. Hey, Kelly. All right. What we're going to do is we're going to take some uh, hamburger that uh, I've kind of pressed into a ball, and we're going to smash those kind of thin and flat, cook those here in just a few minutes. So, y'all, stay tuned. Don't leave it. for y'all. just a Kroger brand, just a grocery band, brand, and I think that's the only, uh, that was the only uh, sweet potato fries that I could find, was the Kroger brand. Uh-oh, straighten up, Lisa made it. Lisa's here. Uh-oh. Oh, Sarah, thank you so much. Police are here. <laughs> I've got, uh, I've got pictures I'm going to post probably in the morning. Okay. Hey, James. Uh, I love Save the bacon. <laughs> save the bacon grease. Save gotcha. the bacon. Whoop, whoop. Save the bacon grease. Y'all, that, that was a blooper from last year. From way back. Yep. And uh, it was so much fun. So y'all need to go back and look up some of his past videos. I forgot what we were cooking that night, but. Well, we know it was bacon. <laughs> it had some bacon in it. And he was talking and telling a story and just spilled that bacon grease all over the floor. And our our good friend Betty decided that <laughs> I needed a T-shirt that said that. And he wears it often, Betty. Uh, Connie, yeah, the Duchess's cloakroom. It's a beautiful one, too. I love it. You know, me too, Francine. I have never met a tater that I didn't like. <laughs> And it shows. 
<laughs> All right, our onions are grilling up a little bit here. Y'all can hear the sizzle now. Lisa, our cool weather is going to be your Wednesday. Uh, Tuesday. Yeah, and right now it's hot. Yeah, right now it's about 80, 80 degrees it's here. Than, like when Cindy was here, it, it was nice and cool, you know. Uh, but it's hot today, and you can feel it in your head. You just know that front's coming. Kind of All right, we're making some headway here, y'all. I can't even make fun of him, Regina, because I say it the same way he does. <laughs> <laughs> yep, we're all from the south. Yeah, as many times as you cook onions on here, I think you've all get an idea of what it must smell like, right? Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. Oh, our fries are beginning to brown up a little bit. Those are going to be good. Well, Gwen, you need to come on back. Yep. <clears throat> it's cold up there. She's got the furnace on. Oh, she goodness. Did, she left Alabama and the south, and now she's back to Oregon. Yeah, it was 83 degrees when she left there. Well, if you're real country, Betty, you say ruin instead of ruin. <laughs> I say ruin, but there's a lot of people say ruin. And you say W-A-S-A. Wash. You said <laughs> Wash. He says wash. I say wash. <laughs> yep. Darla, I know that's headed our way. We get to text in the weather about a day or two later, right? Yep. So we know it's coming. We know to look for it. No, no, really. Nona said you can buy bacon flavored cookie grease. It's called Bacon Up. <laughs> Washington. That's how he says it. <laughs> oh, Betty. See, Betty's in Arkansas, so, yeah, it's headed our way for sure. She said it's supposed to be in the 40s tomorrow. Yeah. Yep, it sure is. Friends didn't get ready. I think it's coming across the country. I feel it in my head. Yep. All right, our onions are browning up real good here. And I'm going to have to turn this down. Lisa, I bet it's a whole new world for you. Having that big new washer. You get it going? <laughs> Listen to what Cindy just said. She said, my box just arrived. No, I didn't accidentally drop that in the box. <laughs> yes, you did. <laughs> Yeah, she, that's inside joke, y'all. Sorry. Yeah. Gwen, we love you, too. We love you so much. Um, I'm so glad you've got that, Lisa. You've had that little bitty stack of a way too long. Muzzle loaded season, and where Betty is, she's watching deer in her yard. Yep. And next weekend is gun season. Trudy said if you put maple syrup on the onions, they brown fast. Really, that's a trick to know. That's Maple syrup. Uh, Sarah, that's about to happen to us. And every time it does, Chris and I, hey, I just, I'm dreading it. Oh, Penny, you deserve that. It's from like 74 at Penny Williams. Where's she in Indiana? Indiana. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, we got our fries going. They're beginning to brown a little bit for us. That's what we want. Get those crisp up a little bit. I don't know if y'all can. Can y'all see? Yeah, you can see the fries, can't you? 
And I'm going to turn that fire down a little bit. Terry asked if the parents will eat this tonight. Uh, as a matter of fact, yes. They're going to get a, a patty melt tonight. Yes, indeed. They're not going to get the special sauce, though. You'll see why. <laughs> yeah, you will have to show you that. All right, we're going to put some burger meat on here. So, now, you roll them in the balls and you uh, chill them, right? I put them in, yeah, I roll them into a, like a three or four ounce uh, ball. And um, put them in the refrigerator to, to cool a little bit. Now we're going to take a press. And the trick about this, doing the press, is to use a piece of wax paper. Put it right on the hamburger and press down real hard. Because actually we want these patties really thin. So are those awesome potato fries? And Cindy, wait till you see the sauce that he's making. You're going to love it. And if you use this wax paper, it keeps the meat from sticking to the to the uh, press. I hope you can see that. All right. So we're going to set this aside now. Get this out of the way. So we want these patties to go out real thin. And then we're going to season them. While they cook, we're going to season this side of them. And I've got just some, uh, it's actually uh, steak seasoning that I'm going to put on here. It's got a lot of pepper in it. And we're going to let those cook. And we're going to about need to get these uh, fries off here pretty soon because they're beginning to brown real nicely. Hey, we will have to send Sarge over. He's our squirrel guy. He keeps the squirrels out of our yard. <laughs> he hey, does, doesn't he? Hey, Renee. Time to chill. All right, so our, our onions are grilling real good here now. They're beginning to brown up real nice and pretty. Let me uh, get these flipped over here. All right, I'm going to turn the fire off on those. And we're going to let these burgers cook until you see the edges of them start to turn uh, a little brown. Then we're going to flip those. We got some cheese. And I'm going to use, tonight I'm going to use some Havarti cheese. That's really, really good cheese, like a, almost like a Gouda. And we're going to let these patties cook real good because we actually want them a little, a little brown. I hope y'all can hear that. That sounds good. And he likes the crispy edges on the burger. He likes Yep. My mother likes to the way the food is good. It is good. Yeah. Michelle uses her barbie to make grilled cheese sandwiches. You know that. Yeah, that's got to be good. Barbie is good stuff. Patty said, did Mr. T always like to cook? Not always, no. I guess, uh, it just, I just kind of learned it a little bit here recently because uh, I'm retired now. Yeah, I always did the cooking, but um, he, once he retired, he just loved to experiment in the kitchen, and I said, yay. <laughs> I'm glad. Chris does, too. He likes to experiment. Uh, when we do have pods, though, we don't have a membership, though. Um, Deb. Can you store your griddle outside your round what about rust? Well, if you treat it and season it and like you're supposed to. We do have a cover. And put a cover on it. Yeah, you've got to have a cutter. Cover. Got to have a cover. 
I was uh, a service advisor in a service department, a service manager. All right, so I'm going to take one each of these grilled onions that I have here, put them on each patty, and when we flip them, they'll go to the bottom side and cook a little bit more. Now, the thing about ours is we are in a freezer room right now, and then in the winter, he uh, winterizes it, so we have a little extra protection that it just be in outside, and it's covered as a seed, so. Michelle's brother on the same job. Mr. T worked in the car business for how many years? 44 years. 44 years. Betty said you left him one little cry all by itself. Where? Oh, how'd she see that? Thanks, Betty. How'd she see that? Hey, Judy, I'm glad you made it. All right, we're going to flip these guys over. They're nice and brown. And the next thing will be to get some cheese on there. And then we're going to start toasting some bread. I've got some sourdough bread. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. I guess Thor's had his bowl a long time today. He has stacked out on the Yes. Yes, he is. Oh, Peggy, that's no good. I don't like ice. Yeah, Barb says she can smell it from there. Hey, Peggy. And what I'm going to do is just butter the bread a little bit. And then I'm going to put a little butter on the grill. We want them to toast real, real good. Betty, can you toss me a piece of bread, please? Yeah. <laughs> Betty said, I think he'd rather you be sitting here and laying across you on the couch, honestly. He was happy. Me and Bo Rose. They loved you being here. Yeah, too. They smell so good. All right, I'm going to put these on the grill with a little bit of butter on the grill. Here we go. He wants to know, is this homemade sourdough? Yeah, sure it is. <laughs> yeah, sure it is. You even put it in that pretty little plastic bag, didn't you? I did. Packaged it all up and everything. Get some cheese on these guys. He says, "Yeah, cheese, yeah." He likes all things. Yep. All things food. All things food. We're just gonna put some good cheese on each one of these guys. <laughs> Who might that be? I do not know. You have my phone. We didn't even plug in the phone. Wait a minute. 
Hope it doesn't run out of juice, right? Right. I'm plugging it in right now. Let me go see. All right. Let's start serving these up now. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a patty and put it on a piece of bread. And then a piece of bread on top of that. And ready to go. Take this. And we're going to do a double patty on this one. Just like that. And let me get another plate here. And we're going to get this guy off of here. Back in business, I have a glue gun from uh -oh. the Zon. Uh oh. Yep. Oh, Gwen. Gwen's dog was uh, defending our house for us when she heard the ring. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Patty, chicken quesadillas are one of my all time favorite things. Hey, Sue, are you putting two burgers on? Somebody said double decker? Yeah. You are? Yeah. That, that messes up my meat to bun ratio. <laughs> meat to bun ratio? <laughs> For Miss Lindy, she wants a single. Yes, Michelle, he's making a sauce. Where do you see the sauce? And we're going to get this cleaned up a little bit while this last one is going here. I know, Cindy, I really, really want to spend some time with uh, Christina and Sherry's uh, book. I also want to finish my book book. Oh, yeah. Regina, you're absolutely right. All right. One more. Uh-oh. I need one more. I'll get it. What? I need a So we're going no, to do. Well, you're not done. The... No, I'm not done yet. Okay, Still sure. up there and look pretty. sandwiches and I, I copied a copy I will tell you that but I, but I kind of used it on kind of figured it out on my own so I'm gonna put a little bit of that on here for 
for Lindy. I got a little taste of that sauce and ooh, darn it, so good. <laughs> so excited he came up with that. All right, I'm gonna let Lindy try this. Ooh. Wait, I'm gonna, Pete, you gotta move. I'm getting you a napkin, baby. Oh, I'm probably gonna need it. Yep. Hot, hot. Last one off. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Mm. How's that sauce? Listen. You got Whataburger beef a million ways. <laughs> oh my goodness, y'all, that's so good. While Cindy was here, we took her to uh, actually fed her at Whataburger for the first time. I don't think I think she said she had never eaten there, but uh, we got her a patty melt there. But these I think are going to be a little better than. Oh my goodness, yes. Yeah, let's see about these sweet potato fries. Oh, those are good. You have got to try this, yo. Tell them a little bit about the sauce. We're going to give you the recipe. But... Yeah, I'm going to post the recipe. It, it is uh, just kind of quickly. It is. Uh, a cup of mayonnaise, um, three quarters of a cup of mayonnaise, some black pepper, some white pepper, some salt, some onion powder, some garlic powder, a little bit of white vinegar, um, mm. a little bit of parsley. Uh, mix that all together real good, and it is really tasty. But I will, I will say this: it's a little, it's got a little bite, and I love that. Oh, it's so that little girl right up, right over there, right over there. Y'all can't see her. She loves, she loves that little bite. Mm, that is, that's better than, I swear, I, I didn't think you could ever do better than a Whataburger patty melt, but this is awesome. He always shoots himself in the foot because we'll go to restaurants <laughs> and have a favorite thing, and then he makes them better than the restaurant. I don't want that anymore. <laughs> yep. Okay, Bonnie said, sorry I missed the beginning. What did you season the burgers with? Everything looks delicious. I just seasoned it with some steak uh, seasoning. Uh, actually, it's a it it is a what they call a Chicago steak seasoning. Let's see what this tastes like. Darla, I would drip. I would dip anything in this sauce. Brandon just made it. Brandon, hey, say hi, Gwen. Plus. When he comes Udern. in, we have, yeah, Udern. That is really good. So good. I've never made these before. Would you, yeah, he just did this sauce this afternoon. Would you put me a little bit of that sauce over here to, to dip my fries in? Mm hmm Oh. Yum. Y'all, this is so good. You've got to make this. He will um, share this sauce. I don't guess you really need a recipe for any of the rest of it. But no, you just, uh. Put this sauce on everything. Make some burger patties, and you know, I'm doing it on Blackstone, but uh, you can certainly. Brandon said to tell you that you have to start all over again. <laughs> okay, here we go. Everybody ready? Ooh, that's good. We have, is yes. that 200 people watching? No, no 110. 110. Um, Peggy, the onion, he grilled the onion, and then he put it on top of the patty. Grill the onions, uh, and you can, do, like I said, we did it on the black stone, but you can do it in a skillet. Grill the onions, you can set those aside. Uh, of course, do your fries in the oven. Uh, cook the burger patties and, and smash those flat, are very, very thin. That It's best if they are flint, thin. Um, let those cook on one side, and when that, when that side is done, Flip it over, put the onion right on top of the of that burger, and then the cheese right on top of that. And oh, yeah. ooh, it tastes good. I asked Cindy about her airport meals. Yeah. And um, Connie. She told us about those that, that airport meal. Connie said, "What is it in the sauce that makes it spicy?" Mm. Excuse me, I was eating. It has two tablespoons. Excuse me for talking with a mouthful. Mm. <laughs> yes, I'm sorry, it has two tablespoons of sriracha in it, yeah. plus the two different peppers. It's got black pepper and white pepper, which give it a just a really great seasoning. It's got onion pepper in it, it's got garlic pepper in it. Onion sauce? Mm. 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 M
garlic powder, excuse me. Garlic powder. If you don't like spices, you can easily leave the heat out. Yeah, you can leave the sriracha out or cut the sriracha way back just to your taste. And do it's really, fries, really delicious. Do the fries get crispy on the blackstone? They do. A little bit. Yeah, not, not real crispy, but they are. I think they would probably do better if we thawed them out before. Oh, really? Okay. I think they would actually do better. They're delicious. Mm. They're, and dip them in that sauce, and they're awesome. Sweet potato fries. They're they're really good. Mm -hmm. So, I'm still eating. I'm sorry. Didn't mean to be so rude. So we're gonna put. Uh, I don't think I'm really going to give you a, a recipe on the burgers. You don't need that. You can cook a burger. Cook a burger, smash it. Uh, but I'm going to put that creamy pepper sauce uh, on the uh, on our side, and then uh, you can adjust it however you want, just like any, uh, any recipe. Uh, you can back off on the pepper if you want. You can back off, back off on the uh, sriracha. But I really appreciate everybody watching us tonight. We always love having all of you here. Cindy Kane is crazy. Yes, she is. <laughs> well, I think she was saying that what she paid at the airport for a meal. Was oh, yeah. Crazy. Yeah. I don't know. if Did you all see that? She had uh, one meal that was uh, some fish and a salad. Is that right? What was it? A meat? No, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Gwen says you should be using your toothpick or spoon on those fries. Because <laughs> of our dinner with a twist. Oh. <laughs> yep, yep. Yep. All right. You know, I had to eat a spaghetti with uh, a knife, so. Yeah, he did. That's a whole story. Cindy told that on her birthday video. All right. I'm going to. Uh, it'll be oh, great with it'll be with great garlic. with chicken. Yes, it would be. Uh, I'll. I'll you can get that I'll type it out real quick and get it. We'll get it posted so you can have it. Okay. This sauce is the bomb, y'all. It's good. This is better than the other sauce you were. Yeah. This yeah. Is so good. I, I made a fan. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. All right, ladies. Thank you so much. We love you. We're gonna let you go. And gentlemen. And gen that's right. Brandon's here. Yep. But anyway, we're gonna let you go. Thanks for joining us. Join us again. Let's see. That's probably going to be Thursday night. Well, I'll be on Sunday morning at 10 if you want to tell them that. That's right, yeah. Lindy will be on 10 o'clock Sunday morning with uh, a mystery box. Yep. Right? Josie sent it to me. It's going to be great. And then she's, of course, always on on Tuesday at 4 o'clock. Love, Love you very much. You. Thank you very much. And we'll see you next time on Cooking with Tater Bugger. <laughs>